Here we are in uh, Gulfport. This is uh, Raynette's hometown. So, well, not hometown. It's just grew up town. So, and here's Gulfport Beach. Um, there's the anchorage. And our boat's almost the furthest one back. But uh, it's nice. We got a nice little dinghy dock here. Dinghy up too. Um, got some tables here. This is called the casino, this building here. I guess back in the day it used to be a casino. They got a couple of restrooms attached to it. There's a restaurant and bar uh, right across the street and also Caddy Corner, volleyball courts. So we are heading to uh, downtown St. Pete on the uh, local transit oh, system. Fun. Huh, the what? PSTA. The PSTA is what we'll be riding. So. Uh, yesterday we didn't take any video. It was, yeah, it was a challenge for the most part. And then uh, lazy day, and we forgot the camera. So try to make up for it today. Well, unfortunately, sometimes we're uh, forgetful, and we forgot to bring an SD card for the camera that had space on it. And uh, this one that we had was full, so we were able to take this video when we first got to, to shore, and then uh, a few pictures, and that was it. It was full, and we were done. Uh, it's kind of a bummer, but uh, we went and found a tobacco place for our buddy Brent to get some uh, tobacco so he can roll his cigarettes, and then we went to the grocery store, grabbed some supplies. Uh, I think we grabbed a bite to eat and then uh, headed back out. So this is day five, we've decided. Huh? <laughs> so this is day five, we decided. Yeah, this is day five after two days of being here in Gulfport. Two days of laundry and yeah. supplying and... Getting stuff we need. There's Gulfport. We're West headed LPL. headed to Sarasota. The sea is quite calm, or the bay. Yeah. Quite, quite calm. Yeah. There's Egmont Key. If we had a little bit more time, we might go over there and check it out. It looks pretty nice beach. Lighthouse over there. That's it. How you doing? Good. We are cruising along. At, uh, let's see. Almost four. Here we are coming into uh, Sarasota Pass. Um, the wind's blowing, I mean, I think it was 18 to 22, gusting up to about 22, 23, I think. Um, the chart actually states uh, to not enter without local knowledge, but uh, we went for it anyways. Um, our buddy Brent got uh, stuck on his first try, so we gave it a shot. Uh, we had to have our sail up because the current was opposing us, uh, but the wind was uh, going with us, so... Uh, make, it makes for, for big chop and stacked up waves. As you can see, they're crashing on the, there's a rock bar over there. Um, and it's, it's, I mean, it, it's, it's, it was pretty hectic, so we really didn't talk in the video. But uh, yeah, it was, it was pretty, pretty rough coming in. And then uh, the same inlet that we came in uh, yesterday that had uh, four to seven foot uh, breakers over this little island here, and then the rocks that are uh, just south of it. Next morning, completely different story. Wind coming out of the uh, east instead of the northwest. Totally changes everything. So, wouldn't mind coming in and out of here with this yesterday, not so much. Hey. What are you doing? Uh, sailing and videoing. Yeah. What are you crocheting? The washcloth. Oh yeah. We need washcloths, don't we? Yes, we do. That's why I make it. <laughs> awesome. Okay, you can go back to crocheting. Oh, thank you. Oh yeah, sure. I love you. Hey. Hey. Day what? Uh, day... Seven. Seven. 
Yeah, we left last Monday. Yeah. We got a short day today. No, today's Sunday. Today yeah. is Sunday. So, so. <laughs> we, left, we left last Monday. So yeah. today makes day seven. Uh-huh. And you're in a Captain Morgan pose? Oh, I'm a captain. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, short day. So Going from Lemon Bay to... Lemon Bay to Pelican, Pelican Bay. Pass. Pelican Pass. Uh-huh. Yeah, we're going to tuck in inside some islands and stay there for a few days and check out the park and install the radio that we haven't installed yet. Uh, permanently install the solar panel that's been floating all over the boat. And yeah, that's about it. And just hang out and relax and recoup after a day's sailing. Days of sailing. Take a hot shower. Takes, yeah. Maybe. If we yeah, can find hot some. showers. All right. This was yep. a really cool bridge. Uh, we both had never seen a swing bridge before, so we uh, we both kind of were in awe of this one. Um, man, it's got to be a big motor to turn that bad boy right there. So um, next year we got a we got a picture of um, guessing what used to be a railroad bridge of some sort, but uh, it was just pretty neat. So we just came in at right there and uh, wound our way through all these. Looked around through there where Brent's sitting. Came over here and picked our spot, and now uh, we are blowing up our dinghy. And then it's doing all the work. Oh, Ray Ray, <laughs> up there pumping it. <laughs> I love you. You're doing such an awesome job. Okay. You're welcome. Oh, yeah, let's look at see what it is. Yeah, she's actually doing yes that little foot that little pump she's inflating our uh, ten and a half foot knee so all right that, i think that's good end of the day made it to pelican pass sun is setting people are blowing conch shells yeah. james caught a fish about the size of his hand <laughs> kind of a bummer he still doesn't feel good either Body. Pretty easy day in the channel. Probably gonna hang out here tomorrow. <coughs> or not. Well, after her little fish comment, I had to uh, redeem myself and ended up catching a trout. We ate for dinner. Very tasty. That's about it. Want to add anything? 